Old ruins, never mind. Hold on, I'm thirsty! Hmm. Okay. Also, last night my throat started hurting. Hopefully I'm not, like, catching something, but... Here we go. Wow! This place is... What is it? Oh, it's a Mew! Hello, Mew. Oh, I can't talk. Right, it's a painting. It's fantastic! Look at it, Riz! Look at all these fantastic paintings and inscriptions on the walls! I know, they're fantastic. <gasps> Whoa, why are they not fully drawn? It's kind of weird. Mew was full body. Kyogre and Groudon were full body. Or Groudon, however you say that. Or Kyogre, however you say that. But Palkia and Dialga are just like, Yeah, I have a head and an arm. Like Lapras said, this place is the old ruins. Okay, the Rainbow Stone Ship should be here. Alright. Yep, that's right. Let's get in there. Okay, let's go get the Rainbow Stone Ship. Rainbow Stone Ship. What? What is this place? I'm not sure myself, but I would imagine it must be the Temple of the Old Ruins. Let's head up these stairs. Okay. That's fair. I thought she seemed like a little more nervous than she probably was. This appears to be the top. Hey, look here. <gasps> Can you fit your fragment there? I'm about to say stone, but it's a fragment. A strange pattern is here too. There's a small hollow spot in the middle. I wonder what it's for, question mark. Oh? What's that? Or what's that, I guess. Hmm? What is it, Riz? <gasps> There's a stone tablet. There seems to be something inscribed here. What are these? These strange runes. This is inscribed with unknown letters, which I cannot read. It's written in an ancient language. You can read that, Grovile? Yes. I've researched extensively to learn about this. So it's written in an ancient language, which I assume means ancient even for this time. And Grovile's from the future! He really found some, like, hidden tomes or stuff to research. Really? Great! Quick, read it! Don't be so impatient. Give me a minute. It's fair, it's gotta be a little bit difficult. Maybe, unless you're really used to it. Because I guess they do kind of look like, you know, just the English alphabet. So, Grilvile. Dots. I've got it. It appears this place itself. This is the Rainbow Stone Ship. Oh! Plot twist! Not quite, but... Pardon? This is it? Yeah, that's right. <laughs> Seems weird, I'm saying, yeah. There is an indentation there. Yes, there is. Here it is. Ivy. This is where it goes. Fit that fragment with a strange pattern on it into the indentation. What? Put the relic fragment in there? That's right. That will activate the Rainbow Stone Ship. We can ride it to Temporal Tower. That's what it said on the tablet. Really? Try it and see. <laughs> she seems excited. Okay. I'll fit it into this hollow spot, as we said. That's quite enough of that. Is it Duskull? Did he follow us? Who? Who's there? <laughs> it must be Duskull. Because they wouldn't have said something like that. That requires words. The Sableye. Ha ha ha. Hoo hoo ha. Ah oh, no, it's Duskull. Or Duskmar. Right, Duskull is the lower one. Duskmar. The Duskmar. How did you get here? <laughs> Quite simple, actually. I had Master Dialga warp us here directly. After all, I knew that you would inevitably come here. But waiting here spared us the bother of having to search for you. I guess it would be allowed to have him directly warp there, considering that this place is between times, I think it was said. So I'm not gonna question that. That makes sense enough to me, actually. Ugh. Hoo hoo ha! I am evil. Unfortunately, you were coming back to the future with me. Sableye, take them to the dimensional hole. <laughs> We're all evil and stuff. Oh no. Hey, there's a dimensional hole. I don't know what that hey meant. Sableye, into the dimensional hole with them. <laughs> psst. <laughs> I like how he starts with a psst. Ivy, and Riz. Yep, 
<laughs> Don't say yep in that situation. Yep is a positive thing. I'm with you. Oh. Oh. That. I thought he was gonna be like, I have a plan. I guess if she got that, then you can say yep. But it's still weird in this tense situation to say yep. Yep is so nonchalant. Yeah, I guess. Or yeah, you know. <laughs> well, well. You display some feeble resistance, knowing that it's futile? You expected anything less? Huh. <laughs> you leave me no choice. Do we have to fight Dasnoir? I'll simply defeat you here, then take you to the future. It makes no difference to me. Ugh. The odds are overwhelmingly stacked against you. How much resistance can you even serve up? I guess we'll see. Show me! Swarm them! And then, oh no, we're being surrounded by Sableye and a Dust Noir. Oh, that's pretty cool music for this boss fight, I think. I want to see what I have first. Okay, for this one, just for this first Ivy Doe, yeah. I want to turn off all of these other moves. I want her to use Flamethrower as soon as possible to try to take out that Sableye in front of her. Um, what items do I have that I could use to my advantage? Um, I have one Sleep Seed, which I could try to throw directly in front of me for Dust Noir. And a Stun Seed as well. As far as these, I have a Totter Orb that can confuse everyone. Which actually might be good here. I'm gonna use this. Oh! Hey! Hey! Okay, that's fine if I don't get to use items, but let me take a turn! Piece of crap game! <laughs> Fine then! Screw you! I don't care! I do care! I find that ridiculous to a large degree. Stupid concept. Okay. I mean, it's like the kind of thing, you know, if you try to- I'm pretty sure, at least in the Pokemon games, the normal ones, if you try to throw a Pokeball at a trainer-owned Pokemon, yeah, it'll stop you, but it doesn't mean that, like, they get a free turn now. That's stupid. Mm, that's stupid. Okay. It didn't even do much to me. I just hate it. <laughs> I figure if we can take care of all the Sableye, then he shouldn't be too big of an issue himself. So let's see. There's only one Sableye left. And I'm fine with keeping Ivy with just Flamethrower right now. That's working out for me. And... Oh right, he has pressure. Gotcha. Hey, Dustmore's gone! So now he shouldn't be... Sableye shouldn't be... Yeah, difficult. No, my orange berry! Gwa! 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 <laughs> He's dying. I. 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 Refuse to lose! Of course you do, because you're an NPC, and the plot demands it. <sighs> so foolhardy. You dared to challenge me? Yeah, we beat you! For all the effort in the world, with your puny power, you had no chance of winning from the start. Uh, that's why it's truly tough. Don't give up. There's a way out of this. That's easy for you to say. Huh. You've done admirably well for those as pitiful as you. But it's all over now. This is the end. The mouth on his stomach, it opened up. I didn't know it could do that. He's, he's going to do something! <laughs> yes, he is. Is he going to unleash a move on us? From that mouth on his stomach? It's possible. Wait a second. The mouth on his stomach? That's it! This could work! What could work? What are we doing? What is it, Riz? I don't know. W what? Force our combined moves down his stomach? Is that possible? There's no time! It's our one-shot, Grovile! Take this! Teletubby Beam! That wasn't the plan. Our combined moves was something else, but I guess tossing a Shadow Ball or whatever back at him worked well enough. Guo! Guo again, I say! Guo a third time for effect! Yep. And he's dead. We... did it! Dustmoir is... down. We've finally beaten Dustmoir! Where... it can't be! 
Lord Dustmar! Lord Dustmar was defeated! And off they go. To report back to Dialga, crap! He can send more assassins our way! <laughs> Your Sableye ran off. You just have no luck attracting reliable allies. Ugh. Ivy. What is it? Go to the top of the temple. Put the relic fragment in that hollow spot. I want you to check if the Rainbow Stone Ship actually works. Meanwhile, Riz and I will keep an eye on Dustmar here. Okay, I'll go do that. Bye, Ivy. Be safe. If the Rainbow Stone Ship works, we can go to Temple Tower. I hope it activates. We all hope it activates, for the sake of the world! Ugh. Don't move! Ugh. Grovile. Riz. Is this really... Is this what you really want? If history is changed, we Pokémon of the future will disappear. What? If history is changed, Pokémon of the future will disappear? It won't be just me. Both of you. Grovile and Riz alike. Since you come from a future that will cease to exist, you will both disappear too. Is that what you really want? If we change history, we'll disappear too? Is Dustmore... Is Dustmore telling the truth? Grovile! Dots. It's true, Riz. If we change history, we will disappear. G Grova! I know, like, he could have said that. I, you know, whatever, but... But, that doesn't matter. If it means restoring time and bringing peace to the world, it's what I came to the past to do. Celebi, too. She helped us, knowing that she would disappear if we succeed. Even Celebi? Oh, I recall when we were in the future. Flashback for those of you who forgot. Besides, if you would be so kind as to prevent the planet's paralysis, we'll finally be spared the agony of this world of darkness. My dear Grovile, I will devote my whole life to achieve that end. I don't remember what she sounded like, but she sounds like that for that moment. Mm. Mm. When Celebi said that she would devote her whole life. So this is what she meant. And Riz, you came with that same resolve. We came from the future fully accepting what would happen to us. But... The way you are now, you don't remember that resolve. I know this is coming as a great shock to you, but we have no choice to, in, in the matter either way. If we don't act, time will be destroyed. The planet's paralysis will begin. To bring peace to this world, we have to disappear. Try to understand, Riz. Dots. So that's how it was. I came to this world with such a resolve. Knowing that if we succeeded, we would disappear. But... If we don't act, the destruction of time can't be stopped. And is that a world worth living in? That means... We have to do it. Even if that means I must disappear. Ah, oh, Riz. But... There's just one thing. One thing changed for us by coming to this world. It's true that we had the resolve to complete our mission. That was true when we first came back to this world. But we had absolutely nothing to lose, and nothing to go back to. But Riz, this changed for you when you became a Pokémon. You found a friend and partner in Ivy. Ivy looks up to you. If your partner found out that you might disappear, I'm sure Ivy would be crushed. Ivy has a good spirit, but... If the future is altered and you disappear, your partner will... Ivy will be... left all alone. I finally understand. If I change history, I'll disappear. If I disappear, Ivy will be... Ivy. Aww. But Ivy's stronger now. Because of us. Because of what we went through together. She's not the same Pokemon she was when we first met her. She can handle it. I mean, it'll suck, yeah, but... She has friends within the guild. She has support now. She's a stronger Pokemon. She's... I believe in Ivy. So, there's that. Even if she is naive and wasted Norenberry. <laughs>
Well, let's see what happens. Here it is. It's this hollow spot. The relic fragment is supposed to go into this spot. Yes, it is. That will activate the rainbow stone ship, Groval said. Let's try it. Okay. I've replaced the relic fragment in the hollow spot. And... Ah, it moved! It moved! It did, it did move, and it's glowing now! What was that? Ivy's done it. That noise. It has to be the sound of the Rainbow Stone Ship activating! Gwoah! Gwoah! I'm alive again! Ow! He slapped me! Gwoah! I won't... You'll never change history. Wah! Oh no. Even after defeating him, he was able to knock us both down. Ugh! Grovile! So you shielded Riz, Grovile? That's taken a heavy toll on you. Very well. You're going down first. Oh no. Ugh! Rawr! hate these little sounds they <laughs> Oh, goodbye guys! But what are you doing?! Ugh. Dustmore! I'm... I'm taking you with me! We're going back to the future! What? What?! Riz, it's up to you now! Oh, the time gears. I'm like, what are those? Gah! Those are... Time gears! Okay, team! The Rainbow Stone Ship's set to go! What's happening? Ivy, this is it for me! I'm taking Dustmar back to the future! Part 3. Huh? What? I can never come back here again. Watch Riz's back. Promise me! What? Take your place for a while? I can't! You must and you will. Because you can, Ivy. You two are... the greatest of combinations. That's right, everyone complained because I'm a grass to just fire type. Man, best combinations. <sighs> Unhand me! Release me! We're almost there. Quiet! Riz. Take care, Riz. I was lucky to have known you. Though the parting hurts. The rest is in your hands. Grovile. Sorry for the hold up, Dusknoir. And then it's all gone. Uh, Grovile. Why? Grovile. The sound of the Rainbow Stone Ship. It's getting louder. Dots. The Rainbow Stone Ship. It looks like it's gonna move. We gotta grab the time gears and run up there. Um, Grovile. Grovile. Is she just so sad? Okay. I don't want to go. I'm too upset. But. Right. If we don't hurry. If we don't hurry, the Rainbow Stone Ship might just leave without us. Dots. Grovile. I may be sad, but right now. We should go. The time gears. The time gears. I better gather them up. You better. Wait for us in the future, Grovile. We'll stop the planet's paralysis. We'll change the future into a better world. A world in which Grovile can live happily. We won't fail. I thought she was talking to Grovile, so saying Grovile can live happily was a little odd. But... What Dustmore said. Really? That just barely happened! Is this really... Is this what you really want? If history is changed, we Pokemon of the future will disappear. That's right. If the future is changed, Grovile will disappear. And... I will disappear too. Say, Riz... The last thing Grovel said to you, Riz. Though the parting hurts, the rest is in your hands. He did say that. His last words. Parting hurts. I understand that feeling. 
I understand how it hurts. Groval was partners with you for a long time, Riz. I think it must have hurt Groval terribly to leave you. That may be what he meant. But no, that isn't it. Groval's last words? They weren't about me and Groval. He meant me and Ivy. Groval said what he did. Because he knew that I would eventually have to leave Ivy. Even though I read that in the wrong order. When history is changed, I'll disappear. My time together with Ivy is ending. This is our last adventure. Hey, Riz. We have to do this for Grovau's sake. Let's go to Temporal Tower. It is sad. It is sad. I mean, I'm feeling something in the back here. Final chapter. The last adventure. Alright. Well, here we are. Wah! It's getting louder! It's about to start moving! Let's get on it, quick! Okay, get on it, quick! And here we go. Wah! Well, who knows where we're going now. But this is pretty cool. <laughs> Except now I'm feeding, thinking of reading Rainbow. That's, I don't know. Oh, look at that! <gasps> Temporal Tower. Temporal Tower! Finally, we're on our way. We're going there. Here we are. All right, well. This could be difficult and very long considering it's a tall tower. We're getting close, Riz. There's no turning back now. Oh, up there. Yes, the top. Oh, the top of Temporal Tower is glowing red. Why is that? Ah, destruction of time. Let's hurry. All right, if it's asking me to save. All right, but once it asks me to save, we're calling it. Just so you guys are prepared, which is probably here. This is. This is the entrance to Temporal Tower. Ah, the ground shaking. Yes, it is. Did it settle down? What was that tremor anyway? Oh, that reminds me. Grova once said something once said something about this. There we go. He said that time started going out of control everywhere because the Temporal Tower began collapsing. So that tremor we just felt. Temporal Tower could be falling apart even as we speak. Hurry, Riz! Okay, hurrying! We're going to save our adventure! And we're calling it here! So with all that, <laughs> thanks for watching! I hope you enjoyed it, if you did, of course, feel free to like, comment, and if you're new, even subscribe. It means a lot, it really helps me out, and I would love to have you guys. So, tune in next time for my next video. Until then, take care. Q outro, go!